And that's it. Wrexham lose 3-1 at Salford. And I've got to say, Che, you can have no complaints about that score then. No, we, we can't. We didn't create anything. Um, Salford was a superior side all over the pitch. I've got to say, I, that's got to be one of the toughest results and one of the worst performances I've got to say of the season so far, Mark. Yeah, we, we were unable again to deal with the physicality of Salford. Yeah. Uh, well, that's what I was saying, with the physicality of a team that got on our faces and pressed as well. Yeah. We played long balls and fought for the second balls. Uh, we had another nightmare start, of course, conceding two goals early on, and both avoidable, the Concord missing a corner for Theo Vassell to head home, and then Lund, um, maybe on Wasp, scoring direct from a corner. But it wasn't against the runner player. Conkwood made three very good saves in the early periods as well. Yeah. To keep us up bet, to keep them at bay. And Dolby grabbed that goal just before half time, totally against the runner play. He just wondered whether we might be able to come back into it. And the start of the second half for a little bit we looked in it, but they came back as us got that third, hit the bar. No, we were lucky to concede three there, to be honest. I think yeah, I think we were lucky to can see three were very very lucky in fact could have been five or six i know it sounds awful but that was a tough one to take i've got to say mark it, man of the match it's hard to pick i've got to say uh, for me i feel that cannon was notwithstanding the two mistakes to me right at the end then uh, i thought it was a lot better than the rest to an extent yeah 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 I think I'll, I suppose I'll have to agree with you on that one. Yeah, yeah. I can't really think of any of the particular candidates. Evans did some good things in the second half, but we just didn't do enough <laughs> at all. We didn't create anything, did no, we? The, no, you know, absolutely. The, there was no individual brilliance from the strikers, which we probably needed at some point. The defence, we're lumping it over the top a lot, and it just wasn't working. We weren't, weren't even lumping it over into dangerous places like Salford were doing. But just looking at the stats, <laughs> we had one shot on target, they had nine. We had six shots, 18 for Salford. I, I think that tells you a lot. It, it, this, I, I'm, I'm not being too overcritical here, but the waveform has to get better oh, gosh, if yeah. we had to stay in the top three. Yeah, something different has got to happen with that. Nine corners to Salford as well, and they would look to fret on pretty much all of them. Oh, so. You've got to give them credit. Um, I think Vassal and Till, the two x men, had excellent games today, you know, and really stopped the strikers from doing anything. And that, that third goal by Matt Smith was a touch of class as well, in all fairness. And they just looked more threatening, they looked more up for it, and it was well deserved by them, unfortunately, for Wrexham. Frustratingly, Stockport dropped points at home to Arrogate, but we've got more points, so we don't get to capitalise under it. So, Disappointing, really disappointing for Rex in yeah. all honesty. Yeah. And yeah, Phil Parkinson will know that he's really got to turn around this away form as we, we keep our title ch challenge a lot to do what else around, right? You, you can sugarcoat that, can you? It, it was a poor performance at the end of the day. Yeah, we dropped out to the top three now in fourth place. Admittedly, you know, we have games in hand over all the teams above us, but still. We've got to be winning points away from home or those games are handled come to north. So frustrating afternoon for Wrexham. And Salford City continued their excellent form with the Carl Robinson. Yeah, all credit to them. Yeah. If they really shown up today. Wrexham certainly weren't at their best. Yeah. We need to pick up this form now. Totally. And the final score of Salford City 3, Wrexham 1. We're Mark Griffiths and Che Long from Wrexham AFC.